Begin reading your task. Begin. Hi, Mr. Ronald. Hello. <coughs> Mr. Ronald, I'm Dr. Raza, one of the doctors in the department. How are you? Not feeling good, doctor. <laughs> okay, don't worry, please. Uh, I'm called by the nurse um, to, to see you because uh, she said that you're vomiting. Yes. Uh, before I start, I just want to confirm your age. How old are you? I'm 62 years old. Okay, and I'm told that you had the endoscopy done today. Yeah. Okay. Can I quickly examine you? Okay. Okay. Let me connect you to the uh, pulse oximeter and check your oxygen saturation, please. Okay. Your oxygen is slightly low. Uh, do you have any condition called COPD? No. Okay. I need to give you oxygen because you're feeling sick. I will give you through this nasal cannula, okay? Okay. Let me put this on. Okay. Now I need to examine your chest and feel your chest as well as uh, listen to your chest, okay? Okay. Can I expose your chest? Yes. Okay, thank you. I have the chaperone with me. Take deep breath in and out. Okay. Let me feel your chest. Okay. Any pain? No. Okay. Your chest sounds resonant. Resonant. Okay, let me listen to your chest. Normal. Deep breath in and out. Normal. Normal. Okay. Normal. Normal. Okay. Are you still feeling sick? Yes, I'm very sick, doctor. Okay, okay. I can see that you have a sickness bowl and there is a bit of blood. Have you been vomiting blood? Yeah, I vomited a lot of okay, blood. Okay, okay, no worries, no worries. I'll find it out why this is happening. Okay, let me uh, pinch your finger. One, two, three, four, five. Capillary refill time is one second. Okay, let me check your respiratory rate as well as uh, check your blood pressure and the pulse. Okay, you're breathing slightly faster. We'll continue the oxygen. Your oxygen is better now. Um, let me feel your pulses. The ball bubble and synchronous. Okay. Present distal pulsation. Okay. And how is the temperature? A uh, cold. Okay. Can I feel your tummy a bit? Yes. Okay. Any pain in your tummy? Yeah, I have pain in my stomach. Okay. Any pain here? Yes. Okay. Let me listen to your bowel sounds as well. Okay, bowel sounds are present and you're feeling sick. I need to put the cannula and take a few blood samples of you and um, I will give you anti-sickness medication. Okay? okay? Are you allergic to any medications at all? No. Okay. Putting the cannulas and are you taking any blood thinning medications? No. Okay, I've taken your blood samples. I put the cannula. Let me give you some IV fluids. Okay, your blood pressure is very low. I can see it is 87. Uh, your pulse is slightly higher. Okay, I've started the fluid. I will request a blood sample for you, okay, and the transfusion may be needed because you vomited some blood, okay? 
Okay. Uh, I will do an ABG that is a quick test to find out the hemoglobin, okay, to, to see if you have lost a lot of blood. Okay. 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 Um, any, uh, how is your pain at the moment? Do you need any painkiller? No, no. Okay. Please let me know if you need anything. I will also give you a meprazole through the vein. Okay? Okay. Yeah. I'll give you 80 milligrams of uh, a meprazole. Okay. okay. Please don't eat or drink anything. Um, and um, tell us if you start feeling unwell. Okay. Okay. Do you know where you are? Yes, I'm in the hospital now. Okay. Let me check your glucose and show you some bright light. Okay. Bilaterally reactive 3.5 millimeter in diameter. All right, thank you. Let me check your glucose. Glucose level is 6.5 millimole per liter. Okay, I will have a look into your drug chart as well. Are you on any regular medications? Yes, I think. Nabroxine. Okay. And omeprazole. All right. Okay. I can see that you are Mr. Stephen Donald, 62. Okay. So you are on um, okay regular medications, naproxen. Okay. And you're not getting omeprazole actually. So I need to give you regular omeprazole uh, as well as uh, I will give you the infusion at the moment because you're feeling sick. I will give you cyclizine and uh, we'll continue monitoring you okay let okay. me check the numbers again okay your pulse is still high um, your ecg looks okay to me uh, your blood pressure is still low okay so stephen i will need to give you blood transfusion because two minutes remaining very low. okay okay thank you i'll give you one negative blood Okay, examiner, um, I've seen uh, Stephen Ronald. He is 62. He was admitted because of the multiple episodes of vomiting and uh, he was, uh, uh, he had the endoscopy done this morning. I was called by the nurse because he started vomiting and I could see that he, he vomited blood as well. So he has a clear evidence of hematemesis. Uh, my, on my assessment, his blood pressure was low and uh, slightly tachycardic and uh, he had slight hypoxia as well. I've started the patient on um, oxygen through the nasal cannula because he was feeling sick and uh, he had the vomiting as well. I've started the patient on IV fluids, keeping him nil by mouth, taking uh, all the blood samples including UNEs, LFT, CRP, coagulation profile. I've also taken the samples for the group and save uh, and uh, continued observing the patients. The patient's glucose is normal. However, his uh, blood pressure after the resuscitation did not improve. So I have started the patient on blood transfusion O negative. Uh, one unit is going on and uh, I will continue monitoring. If he does not improve, I may need to give him another and he may need to go to theta as well for another endoscopy. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Move on to the next station.